Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the biggest show on earth that has already been created by Quote 412. Late last few days ago, hello everyone, I'm your commentator MJ. We're coming alive all the way from Portland, Oregon. Yeah, no doubt about it in my mind here. Portland, Oregon has already gotten jam-packed to the arena tonight, all the way to the Raptors. And this is going to be a big-time show. Colt 412 is at home watching this. And we'll be told he's going to be hosting the vote personally. But the question on my mind is, we know that kicking off the show is the HWF European Championship match. But who is going to face Solo Sokoa? Right now, though, we take you straight to Colt 412's home. As right now, though, this is going to be a war. Who is the one who got the most votes, and who's going to take on none other than Solo Sokoa? Oh, heck yeah! Hello, everyone. It is yours truly, the owner and the creator of TNW, and more importantly, the creator of the 412 and Sonic series, Cool 412. Man, I got to say, though, you guys have been requesting so many great matches over the past few years. I've decided to make this matchup and this show personally, TNW Viewer's Choice, for you guys at home, get to the side of what matches you guys want to see. And I hope this show becomes a big one, because all I can say is right now, let's get to the votes, because the first match of the night, as MJ pointed out, the HWF European Championship on the line, Solo Sokoa, going up against three choices you guys voted at home. Who do you want to see? Fox McCloud, Rey Mysterio, or Monkey D. Luffy? Well, I'll be a son of a gun. It's Monkey D. Luffy with the highest votes over Rey Mysterio and Fox McCloud. And all I got to say is, folks, it's going to be a wild ride here on TNW Viewer's Choice. And right now, though, let's take you to our ring announcer for the introductions for this HWF European Championship match. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, and it's for the HWF European Championship. You heard right from, ring, from the ring announcer, HWF European tie on the line. And here comes Monkey D. Luffy. He won the votes by a grand slide. You know that about it. It was more likely a grand slam as far as I do know. Monkey D. Luffy earned the right to get a shot at the HWF European Championship since both Nico Robin and Sanjay won the mixed match tag team tournament. Monkey D. Luffy lost his shot at the world heavyweight title. He may get another one in the near future. No doubt about it. That is if Rowan Noah Zoro doesn't lose the hardcore title. No, he's also got a boat coming up sooner or later. Or we might see that anytime soon. No doubt about it. We just don't know what's going to happen here in these votes. TNW viewers choice is coming alive all the way from Portland, Oregon. And right now though, this is truly become an amazing night here on TNW viewers choice live from Portland, Oregon. How about it here at these fans in Portland, Oregon are really sold out to the Raptors. And right now though, here comes Solo Sokoa, the HWF European champion. And no love loss here for Solo, no less. A member of the bloodline making his way to the ring as HWF European Champion. And heck, I'm already happy enough to know that Jimmy and Jey Uso made their choice when they left the bloodline. Not how about it, but however, here on, H here on TNW standards along with HWF, the bloodline are still intact a little bit. But speaking of the bloodline, Jimmy and Jey Uso will put their HW full tag team titles in the line against a team that the people at home got a chance to choose. No doubt about it, Solo Sokoa. The street fighter of Las Vegas, Nevada, already a street fighter in his own rights, the street champ of the bloodline. No doubt about it, former FSW superstar, and the one time he wrestled, for Big Valley Wrestling. Let's go to our ring announcer for the introductions for this championship match. Introducing the challenger from the open seas, weighing in at 148 pounds, Monkey D. Luffy. And his opponent from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 200. 
at 50 pounds, he is the HWF European Champion, Solo Sikoa! Well, these fans here in Portland, Oregon don't like Solo Sikoa one bit, and I think I knew better. Right as we came on the air here, I heard the fans chanting, the bloodline sucks. You think? The Bloodline are here on TNW Viewer's Choice for a reason. Not how about it? Cool 412 made the announcement known a few days ago, late last weekend. And something tells me, TNW Viewer's Choice is going to be a big time show that nobody will ever forget. Not how about it? Referee in the ring calls for the bell, and here we go. Here we go. Actually, I'm being told from the floor by business partner Jenny Wakeman. I was correct. Rowan Nozor will put the hardcore title on the line in the hardcore division with any superstars the fans at home picked. Well, it's going to be a big time moment for any superstar in the HWF locker room. Whoever the three are, we're going to find out coming up later on. No doubt about it, because after this matchup, up next in the viewer's choice, the fans at home have been, have been voting on what match they want to see with Hulk Hogan and none other. Then, of course... The legendary John Cena. Not that bad. We're being told that Hollywood Hogan is already is already uh, not here tonight because we're getting the real Hulkster here tonight. Not that bad. It. Luffy, springboard cross body, and nobody home to make the contact. And unfortunately, there was no water left in the pool. And right now, though, Solo Sokoa using his Street Fighter arsenal to do whatever it takes to retain the title tonight. And now Luffy firing back here, hoping to add another HWF championship to his resume. Former HWF World Tag Team Champions and a former HWF Tag Team Champions. Not that about it. Monkey D. Luffy's done it all here in TNW's record books. Most precisely also in ACW's record books. Well, the HWF record books, including the ACW record books. As Luffy's done it all in this business, I'll tell you. The Straw Hat Pirates were the only tag team to ever hold on to the ACW championships. And a dangerously low blow by Solo Sokoa. Monkey D. Luffy down and out. Uh-oh. Luffy back to his feet. Springboard crossbody connected that time. And Solo's down. Cover. No. Only gets a one count. Nicely done by Monkey D. Luffy here at TNW Viewer's Choice. As we are coming alive all the way from Portland, Oregon. What the? What's this now? I don't know. And right now, though, Luffy looking around, wondering what's going on. Referee distracted. And it, wait a minute. Jey Uso with a chair shot. Steel chair on the head of Luffy by Jey Uso. Referee sees the smoking gun, but did not see Jay made the contact. Uh-oh. It made Luffy mad, but he's back on one feet as Solo's back to his feet first. And what's Luffy thinking here? I don't know. Monkey D. Luffy already back to his feet. Going for a clothesline, and it made Luffy mad after what Jay just done, getting involved in this match. Not that bad. It. Knowing he will, he, him and Jimmy will put the World Tag Team titles on the line of the HWF. The HWF World Tag Team titles on the line here on Viewer's Choice. We still have no idea who got voted, and we're going to find out. Oh, my God. Solo sending Luffy over the top rope. Right in front of the HWF and TNW announcers table. As far as I do know, these fans here in Portland, Oregon may be taking home some TNW seats tonight because this has already become a big time show thus far. No doubt about it here. Uh-oh. STO takedown by Luffy on the outside. Did the damage. And there's a big arm wrench knee lift. Shades of the late great Harley race. No doubt about it. And Luffy going for a cutter on the outside. Oh, my God. Shades of the legendary Diamond Dallas Page. And it looks like Luffy did some old school tonight. And there's a DDT. Shades of the, of the legendary Hall of Famer, Jake the Snake Roberts. It looks like Luffy is pulling off some old school style. He must have did his homework before coming out here tonight. Yeah, well, both men need to get back in the ring or this matchup will result in a draw. And there will be no winner. Ref at seven. Oh, wait a minute, what's Luffy doing? If it ain't. And Luffy tearing apart the HWF announcer's table, which took advantage, taking Solo down with a clothesline. A smart move there by the challenger. Get inside the champion's head. 
Super kick into an uppercut combination maneuver by Solo Sokoa. Solo Sokoa, the brother of Jimmy and Jey Uso, who nailed the Samoan drop on Monkey D. Luffy. Solo Sokoa is the legit brother of the Usos, and last I checked, is the cousin of Roman Reigns. No doubt about it, the third cousin of the bunch. And a big right hand by Solo Sokoa, and Luffy now in trouble, rolling out to the floor. A smart move there by the challenger. But then again, maybe not. Incoming! Axe handle! Right on the outside. My God, that had to hurt. Uh-oh. Luffy's mad, but Solo preventing anything what Luffy's trying to do there to try to get back here in this fight. No doubt about it. Rep at a three count here. And Solo bringing Luffy back to the ring, right where the action has to be. And Solo maybe looking for the end with that Samoan spike. If he hits this, this was over. Oh, Luffy reversed it. Face buster. Uh-oh. Luffy from the apron. Oh my God, Luffy. He calls that the gum gum launch cover. And Luffy's the new HWF European champion. We have a new HWF European champion. Here is your winner and new HWF European champion, Monkey D. Luffy. Luffy's done it. We have a new HWF European champion. And what a way to kick off TNW's viewer's choice. No doubt about it here, folks. And right now, though, folks, we got to take a break here. We'll be right back. As we already know, that coming up next is John Cena versus Hulk Hogan, the dream match of the century, happening once again here on TNW, and the biggest match that nobody thought they ever see, two of the biggest icons colliding. But how about it? But the question on everyone's minds is, what match did people voted at home to see? We're going to find out. Come to you live and next.